Stephen Hawking's last words. greatest minds of our time and you gotta disrespect the man like that Who, whoever made that you you're not a good person and neither am i for laughing i i'm a bad person too we're in this together but anyways we are back with some funny tiktoks if you laugh you get burnt toast for breakfast with me because i already laughed and before we get started as always subscribe turn on notifications for the channel follow me on social media links are down below and let's go oh butterfly Gentle. eat it Eat it. Gentle. Do it. Just Gentle. eat it. <laughs> Did he make it? Is the butterfly okay? He's not okay. <laughs> the moment before it all just went to crap. That dog was plotting. He was really debating it. Look at him. The debate going on in his head. You can see it in his eyebrows crinkle and he's like, ooh, I'm hungry. But what do I do? <laughs> she gonna be mad at me, but I'm feeling snacky. <laughs> hey, that rhymed. I can freestyle now. I'm gonna come out with a rap album next week. SoundCloud. Does anybody else keep like small snacks under their bed for when no. they're just feeling lazy and they just... Oh, what? Dude, that's a whole meal. That ain't no snack. I'm a snack. That is not a snack. You got a whole plate of spaghetti and meatballs with Parmesan sticking that under your bed. That's nasty. You know how much dust is under your bed? And if you have a pet, the hair is everywhere. And it probably snuck a meatball under there while you wasn't looking. That's gonna be disgusting. And I guarantee you, when he's like bringing it up to his bed, it spilled everywhere. But spaghetti with some meat sauce. Oh, that's that's a comfort meal to me. If you hate on pasta, we can't be friends. Comment below your favorite pasta sauce. Are you a marinara or an Alfredo girl? And I love bread. I just me too. <sighs> just we get it. <laughs> Yo, for real though, that's me. Like I just want to smell him. I want to bite him and just like melt into him. Girls, you get it when you cuddle in. It's never close enough. You just take a bite out of their arm and then a smell off of their shirt. That's why we steal your hoodies, guys, because it smells like you and we want to carry you with us all day. But bread, though, a fresh loaf, mm, that is a whole new kind of love. All right, this you need to cut your hair. Me throwing a random object at my roommate, him trying to guess what it is. Oh, that's going to hurt. Ooh. <sighs> Ice cream, cream cheese. Hey, that was close. <laughs> Why did you have to waste perfectly good cream cheese like that by throwing it on the floor? That could have gone on my bagel. Yo, my favorite cream cheese is strawberry. Comment below your favorite. Fight me on it. He fit though. I really need to stay focused. <laughs> he was close though. I guess cream cheese kind of would feel like ice cream if it wasn't melting already because ice cream melts pretty quick. It would be a lot colder. That was a baseball throw. <laughs> he put every ounce of self-hatred into that throw. All the frustration of not making it to the baseball leagues. <laughs> Y'all doing some window shopping? What? She literally tripped over nothing. She tripped over all them Weight Watchers points she been saving up. <laughs> I'm a bad person. Seriously though, what happened? Lit that Did that old lady trip you? It kind of looks like she did. <laughs> Like, why are you mad? Old people really begin frustrated over the most random things. Kitty. He don't want to exercise. This is every short person trying to keep up with their tall friends. Y'all walk so much faster, you need to slow down. <laughs> He's like, that's what you get for exercising. Get out of my way. Yo, this is that old lady tripping the big chick in front of her on the street. Ah! Why are you mad though? You jealous. He's just mad. He's jealous that that dog can go for hours and that cat can't go up the stairs without dying <laughs> like the rest of us. <laughs> Rhaenyra, when Kristen Cole asked her to run away with him and leave her crown, the Iron Throne, her people, her family, friends, her luxurious life just to become his wife. For real, dude? Like you really thought she'd say yes? You weren't even cute enough for all that. And then he threw the biggest fit. I just spit everywhere, that's disgusting. He had the biggest pity party and then he hated her and did everything he could to team up with the queen to make her life a living, you know what? I hate him. On another note, they did not have one good looking person in the entire cast. Fight me, that's just me though. They couldn't get one good looking A-list actor in there. But if the rumors are true, 
that Henry Cavill left The Witcher to go be on the next season of this show, I'm about to be the biggest fan. <laughs> Cause I low key hated this show until it got kind of interesting in the last two episodes. Still don't love it, but when Henry gets in there, I'm gonna act like I was a fan from day one. <laughs> Texting the vet to ask, was it absolutely necessary to whistle and say, what a chunky monkey we have here today in front of everybody. <laughs> That's like when your mom roasts you in front of the whole family at the Christmas gathering, saying you're fat and you don't do anything with your life. For real though, pets are always called fat. Like, more than anyone else. Bred for generations to be the perfect tracker. The definition of you had one job. Dude, the deer is literally right behind him, just waiting for him to catch him. And the dog is like, what's over here? You could literally hear it before you smelled it. This dog is broken. Nah, this is me looking for who's spending all my money on Postmates and streaming subscriptions I don't use. <laughs> Netflix, I'm looking at you. Stop getting rid of all the good stuff. No, but literally I downloaded the Stars streaming app to watch Outlander. And then I canceled it a week later when I was done with it. <laughs> yes, I cancel things and I actually unfollow people if you get boring. Oh, Yo, do not take your girl sushi. White girls, especially in their sushi, do not play. Do not try to take my salmon sashimi. I will bite your hand off. But on another note, that is the cutest little teacup chihuahua thing. I don't, it looks like a mix of a chihuahua and a pug and a gremlin. <laughs> this is like the worst level of a hangry girlfriend. <laughs> Just give her the food and then walk away and come back in 10 minutes after her food has settled. She's a totally new person. She's gonna be dancing, eating her sushi like, hey babe, how's it going? <laughs> like you literally just tried to murder me 10 minutes ago. It's fine, just move on. Ooh, you get a little late night snack? <gasps> Ew! <laughs> Look at that rat, he literally, Ratatouille literally just robbed you and then popped his head back in like, yeah, what you gonna do about it? You can't catch me, ha! <laughs> and then he dipped. This is me applying for the I think something's wrong with my cat sweepstakes. The um, what? His Never name heard of that. Is, uh, Trevor Lawrence. And you can basically do whatever you <laughs> want with him. Um, that ain't a cat, that's a noodle. To care. And this, he might twirl a little bit, but like. That is an overcooked you know, spaghetti like, noodle. He really just does not give. That's so cute. About like what you do with him. <laughs> Like Your cat is broken. Like, them, like do this. <laughs> Nothing. No response whatsoever. Okay, before That's... PETA comes for this guy, relax, the cat is fine. If you have a cat, you understand. A cat will not allow you to do anything to it that it is not okay with. That cat would tear his face up if he was mad. Trust me, the cat's happy. He thinks they're playing. <laughs> but anyways, that is it for, if you laugh, you have to eat burnt toast for breakfast. I'm sorry if you lost, I know I did. But low key though, I burn my toast every day anyway, cause my toaster broken, but it's cute so I can't throw it away. It's pink. But yeah, again, please subscribe, turn on notifications, follow me on social media, and I'll see you tomorrow.